I, for one, hope I never see that girl ever again. I'm pretty sure she'll be back real soon. Keep your eyes and ears open. There's another way right there. Where? Oh, by that way. Different path. Uh, you wanna go down this one? Uh, we already on this one. I was well checking it out. This is this is sad. So. Restore restoration. Something on the table over here. Dangerous, unstable structure, sight unstable. So there's going to be some falling through the floor, probably moments. Yeah. Okay. We're about to be chased again. Dude's like, get out of here, devil. That girl definitely bought it. Love to know the whole story of what happened. Well, I mean, at least we damn got into some cover, though. Yeah, but it showed did a sledgehammer for some reason. Yeah. Okay, we'll go this way. Come and check this out. Looks kind of beautiful, don't you think? Kind of weird looking. No, this cannot be. My own eyes deceive me. My apologies for the lateness of the hour. But I must speak with you. What ails you, my friend? It is Mary. I am troubled by her. By the part she has played in these trials. Those trials trouble us all. There is more to this. I saw her smile as her own sister was executed. She took pleasure from it. Are you certain? I am. But now that she speaks of guilt and remorse, it is hard not to believe her. Keep away from her, Abraham. No good can come from being with that child. Too late. With her brother and sister gone, Mary now lives under my roof. Your charity places you in grave danger. What do you advise? Tell the court you suspect she toys with us all, but you saw her delight in her own sister's death. I implore you. I am torn. Mary seems full of remorse. Keep suspicious to yourself, and it's our community which will suffer. None of us is safe from her. Wild imaginings. Very well. If the court will listen, I will speak. I am bewitched. You're not bewitched. How else can your presence be explained? I can't explain this, but you're not. She has conjured you to defend her. To press me into silence. Only the devil could create a demon who so resembles me. I'm not a demon. But we do look alike, which I agree is pretty damn weird. What do you want from me? I want to know what you're going to say to the court. About Mary. I was decided to speak to the cause. Now I'm not so sure. I know how this must look, but you have to speak out. Tell everyone what the girl did, like your friend is telling you to. The devil has sent you to tempt me. I must not succumb. Little Hope is no longer the town I knew. Strange and disturbing events have become commonplace. You, whatever you are, are but one of these. Revealing the truth about Mary may save my friend, but it does not sit easily with me that in doing so I condemn a child. Putting it all on a kid isn't right. The priest is the one driving this whole thing. That's way off. We gotta stop the kid. No other way to do this. Reverend Carver is a man guided by God. No one can doubt that.
Oh, we're about to fuck on retard. Bad move there, man. Standing up for the kid is probably gonna do us all in. I hope you're wrong. For all our sakes. What happened? Oh, you get a chance to confront Mary? No. We never even saw her. Fuck. I don't know what to do, dude. Do I shit on a girl? Do I damn try to work around a girl? I don't know. Just pick something, I guess. We met up with Andrew's double, Abraham. He was thinking about testifying against Mary, but good boy Andrew talked him out of it. That was a smart move. Are you fucking kidding me? We are seeing glimpses of what happened here hundreds How you doing? Years ago. Not great. Demons from the past? Don't know how much more of shit I can do today. One thing I didn't see coming, I feel like one of the team. I'm good with that. N never happens to me. Yeah, I hear that. Learned a few things about myself tonight. Shame it had to be from witches and ghosts. We could have used one of those, uh... What do you call it? A paladin of Holy Warrior. <laughs> Holy shit! I never had you down as a game geek. There's a lot more about me you don't know. I'm full of surprises. You'll see. We need to get moving. sent me to a dead end and I had to turn around. It almost got me. Let's check that out. It'll get us yeah. out of these damn woods and we can talk on the way. Coming or not? What 
happened back there with that thing? Whatever it was, it's gone, and it ain't coming back. I really hope you're right. Only a matter of time before they come after us again. That's a pretty negative outlook you got there. The only way out of this freaking nightmare is to stop Mary, stop her lying. You had a chance to get Mary exposed for what she is. A liar and a faker. Put her in the dock for a change. Why didn't you take it? We don't know for sure that stopping Mary will help us out. It's just a theory. It may only be a theory, but right now it's all we've got. This is a one-shot deal. We get it wrong, and there's no replay. It's game over, so I'm up for doing whatever it takes. Come on. Let's take a look. Sure, I've been here before. Hmm. Yeah, let's look around first. Here. See, I think what fucked us up is we initially went through the bottom door. That thing came after us. Hey! That guy's a menace. I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. Come on, inside. been here for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> now is my turn to speak before the judge. I am filled with dread. I cannot know how my testimony will be received. The devil has blinded so many to what is real and what is not. Nothing good will come of this. His words will seek to twist the truth. Allow me to judge what is true. Abraham and Joseph are allies in this deception. And lest we forget, you condemned Joseph to death only yesterday. Or do you now question that decision? I have heard nothing today to sway my conviction. Joseph consorted with the same malicious force as his wife. For this the court thanks Reverend Carver who faced the devil's wrath to present the evidence. It is only my duty, Judge. Now, however, this court is duty bound by law to seek out the truth. We must therefore examine these claims made by Abraham against Mary. If I may speak briefly, Judge Wilder. Time is short. Be indeed brief. Mary has shown great fortitude to speak out against the evil here. Many would have lacked her courage. Yet her reward for exposing this brooding covered in our midst is to be besmirched. Her courage is not in question. It is her intent we must be certain of. Her accuser is the very man entrusted to care for this innocent child. Plain to see, he is not fit for such a task. And I would ask the court to have Mary placed elsewhere. Who would you have be her new ward, Reverend? I am prepared to take responsibility for the child. If the court agrees. First, the court must hear what Abraham has to say. No decision can be made on the child. be very careful about, about what we do to you. Abraham! What am I to do? Some would have me speak out against Mary, but could a child truly be capable of such evil? Don't you, the kid... Uh, oh. Are you for real? The kid is guilty as hell! Just... You must do what you believe is right. I don't know what to do. Tell the court what you have come here to say. Speak up, boy. Out with it! Mary has spoken of evil spirits, devilry and witchcraft. 
things many cannot believe could exist here in the I'm not here for history and hearsay. Get to the point, boy. Mary is tormented. The apparitions she has seen, they have plagued her. Stolen her innocence. Some suggest she is in league with these creatures, but no one can be certain. Myself, least of all. Can any of us truly know a child's mind? You claim I lack the ability to see the truth. I beg forgiveness. I would never suggest such a thing. My time is not for wasting. You and the priest have irked me enough for one day. I have more to say. I have already given you enough time. Furthermore, Mary is to be placed into the care of Reverend Carver. Now stand down. I'll go the way out of that. Andrew's next. You should have went straight for the point. Tell me everything. Did you see Andrew's double again? Was be I told the judge that Mary did nothing wrong. Like, she's the victim here. Oh, that's bad. Very, very bad. Shit! So what happens now? This helps us. Has to. We now know for sure that we can alter what happens. What do you think? Is he right about this? It went down just like he said. What the fuck? We can't stay. Let's get out of here. Sledgehammer here. Yeah. Wait, this is the factory the father was working at. I found a picture. No way. Come take a look at this. Everything was ahead of me. You won't believe this. But we're in this photo. All of us. This is too much. Way too fucking much. First, a load of weirdo witch killers from ancient history look just like us. Now we got the creepy family of the year winners who also look just like us. What the actual fuck? What does it mean though? Do you think they died like the other lookalikes? No clue. Who knows what happened to them? Maybe we're all stuck in the same nightmare. You really want a souvenir from this night? From this place? All I know, I'm keeping hold of this. What you said about all this being a nightmare. Andrew makes a better decision making here. Did you go downstairs? There's a, there's a letter in here. I didn't look at it. Yeah. Is that from the dad? I don't know. Don't leave me up here, dude. Oh, your girlfriend's looking out a door window. You mean your new girlfriend? <laughs> no, still yours. Which way did you go? Did you go deeper to the factory or did you go in the morning? I went deeper. I don't know what's real here. What's Are you the real room? Andrew? Oh, come on. There's a newspaper sitting here. Shot over the damn sledgehammer. 
Little Hope factory to close, hundreds of layoffs will gut the town. Yeah. You found a letter? Yeah, I'm not good though. I got a cigarette sitting right there. Why'd you go down, like, to the one in the hallway beside the stairs? Yeah. So wait, who are those people in the photograph? Maybe time is fucked up here. Like, that really is us in that photo. But they're around the same age as us, as far as I can tell. The factory has been closed due to liquidation of Little Hope Textiles. Following several incidents since the closure of the factory has been placed off limits. Attempt to be in a and treat as a criminal trespass. As this place is about to fall off the car. Let's see that sledgehammer yet. I found a picture of dude, black dude, and that chick with that picture's torn off. Tanya and Vance. Yeah, in the locker. Oh, so he works here too. All right, I found something to push. Hold on. Hold on. I'm looking. In. Can you help me out here? No, dude. I'm looking. Doing what? You take that side, I'll take this side. Push together, right? Good. Now, push! Move, move there. Here come your double. Daniel? You okay?
we need to do Yep. That thing looks to have gone, but it could come back any time. We have to keep moving. Those heartbeats, like, if it's, if the next one, we're gonna be even faster, man. Be very damn careful. Some shit's removing. I think we're coming up to the old cabin, maybe. Pleased to see you. Same here. Who's that? Uh -huh. Wait, what's that way out there? Dude, there's somebody standing out there. There's a little girl. We're not gonna check that out right now. We're gonna check out the car. <laughs> Get over here now! Oh, this is the house we're all burned in. <laughs> Stay on your toes. Anything could happen. Die today. Not even your wife Amy was spared your lust to serve Satan. Damn me if you must. You're not fit. Speaking of my late wife. There is still fight in you. I must drive the devil out for the safety of everyone here. No one is safe. Joseph, do you renounce the devil and all his teachings? I can't even not see. I'm not a disciple. Of the devil. I promise you, Betsy, we my this. Roy, but take servant. We have to stop this. Get away. You give me that. Look. See how this poor child is tormented. Joseph still clutches her with the devil's hand. More stones! The devil must be crushed from within him. Do not flinch. The fate of little Lord rests in your hands. To confront Mary or help him? 
there if I confront Mary, people see her doing something like with the devil or something. Kind of convince the her. Last time I messed with her too. What happened? Tell me. We don't have a lot of time. Time for what? I can't get away from this thing. I'm not letting what happened to Daniel happen to me. Are you crazy? We gotta move. John was looking out for all of us. Nobody deserves that. Especially not the professor. I think it's pretty much going to cut to the other person now. He's a good guy. Place looks like it burned down. Something here isn't right. What's new? Nothing here feels right. Give me a call. Oh, I'm Angela. I'm Andrew. Uh, uh, I'm at the front, front door with a uh a gun button. What the hell was that? A little girl's in the house with them. I just had a premonition. What a little girl's going upstairs? Come here and examine this. There's something on the ground out there. Thanks for the photograph of us. James and Andy. It's me and the professor. You might want to see this. I know who I married, and it wasn't John. This isn't happening. Back to that room, and it's on the other side, way over there. Over here? Yeah. Hey, well, my analog stick keeps the fuck on it. Yeah, I thought. 
Do you see that other random woman that didn't have anything to do with us? Yes. How do we go upstairs? Where's Taylor? You hear that? I did. Could only be the girl. Let's go find her. Where'd Tyler go? Uh -huh. She's in here. No way. I assure all gathered here today that our town will be free of the devil's grasp. Together, by God's grace, little hope will prevail. My word on it. This court is hastily convened, but with good reason. If we are to finally rid ourselves of the evil which has infested the Lord, then we must act today. I accuse you, Mary, of witchcraft. What say you, Reverend? The evidence, as discovered through my investigation, is beyond question. Mary uses her puppet as a familiar to summon and serve the devil. We have been deceived by a child, by her guise of innocence. This puppet was mistakenly used to denounce Tabitha, but it has always belonged to Mary and Mary alone. She allowed her own kin to be executed as she watched in silence. That is not so! Liar! Now this tiff, child, this creature of Satan has the marrow to accuse me, a man of God, of wrongdoing. Whatever she pulls, do not fall for her little girl act. She may be a child, but there's no doubt she means harm. She's malicious. It was never my intention to bring to this town. Or its people. They what can I do? If I could do something to stop this, I would. But now in her hour of greatest need, I this child of the damned pleads once more for the Wait. devil's help. I beg the court's indulgence. Please guide me this time. This is your you counsel. Know. You better choose wisely. We have to stop this. The only madness is right here in this court. Carver, he's the evil one. We have been swayed by malice. The truth hidden from us, but not by Mary. Reverend Carver is the one urging us to believe in the devil. Be silent. This is all You'll his not deceive doing. us any longer. Your true purpose is plain to see. I will see this town purged of all evil. He's right. Listen to what he's saying. Carver is to blame. What must I do to bring this all back into the line? Okay. I fear the Reverend and what he's capable of. If it's the doll that's evil, then destroy the damn doll. Then you'll be rid of it. The Reverend is right to blame the puppet. That is what has cast its spell on Mary. Destroy it, and she will be restored. Released from its curse. 
If your puppet truly holds Mary in an evil grip, then let us destroy it. See if the child can be freed from its spell. Reverend, burn the puppet. Destroy it! You must not act in haste. The girl must face the full consequences of the deeds. My authority is not for questioning. Do as I ask. You've done everything right. you could. Whatever happens, it's not your fault. Because it was basically the doll. And the Revenant wanted to destroy the doll, so. He didn't want to, yeah. Do we think that's it? I figured that if the doll. And then that would be the end of it. You made the right decision. There's no way you could have known what was going to happen. Let's just get out of here. Whatever questions we still got, they won't be answered now. Let's just get out of here. That child won't be troubling us again. This is over. Too. All right. I guess we knew it was gonna be put off on between these characters. No, we're just gonna stick with one character now. I guess this dude's gonna come talk shit to us now. Yep. Some real tough time these past years. He lived about half a mile or so. There's a diner with a working phone. You call for help and you leave this place, and don't you ever come back. Ain't nothing left here for you.
Yes. We could have made it. I'm real sorry for what I put you all through. That's gonna haunt me forever. You're not alone here. Take it easy on You've yourself. Been through hell. Hell, right? Finally getting out of this hell. Dude. He's the bus driver. I just wish we all could have made it. Just shut up! This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? That's funny. Sounds like you could use a drink. Better. Thanks. I need to get a clear head. Anything you can do to help us would be greatly appreciated. There's no goddamn us. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can get a different result. We will. That's the problem with demons. If you don't lay them to rest, they will haunt you forever. Not a bad effort. Some found redemption, some didn't. All your duty. And you... Eventually, found him. The bus driver. Maybe he can now put the past behind him. <laughs> Till we meet again. Maybe in the South Pacific, or the Arabian Desert, or somewhere else. But we will meet again. At least one more time.